Hey YouTube, uh, I'm home. It's I'm at home sick right now, so if I sound weird, that's why. Um, I just wanted to make a quick video with a tip for trans guys. It's uh, with preparing your chest for surgery or healing it after surgery. Um, I noticed that I had a very bad problem from binding. I don't bind anymore. Um, still pre-up, but I don't bind anymore. Um, my skin was being worn really, really thin on my chest from binding. Like, I was losing elasticity. Like, it felt like I could pick up my skin and almost with my hands rip it. That's what it felt like. It felt like I could rip my skin with my hands, like it was paper almost. Um, and... I was very worried that I wouldn't be able to have surgery if my skin on my chest was so thin because of, um, well, skin elasticity is one of the major things they check for before they even allow you to have surgery. And when you're young, like in your 20s, like I am, it's not even supposed to be a problem. Uh, when you're older, you're less likely to be allowed to get the surgery because of your skin elasticity. Um, and when you bind it does mess up the skin on your chest and that's that's the problem that I was having I, I bound for about four or five years and the skin on my chest was wearing really really thin and had no elasticity um, so what I did was I did a little bit of research and I found out that uh, lotion with collagen in it can help actually restore depleted skin and put the elasticity back in and I actually went and found something that works uh, I found this for ten dollars at Walmart so gold bond ultimate restoring with coq10 the coq10 that is the key ingredient right there that is the collagen you need collagen to replore to replace um, the elasticity in your skin. If you want it, if you want that elasticity back, you need a lotion with collagen in it. This was about ten dollars. Uh, it's a four and a half ounce tube. You can see how big it is compared to my hand. Now, for me, I actually noticed a major difference after the first application. And I know, like, there's commercials out there all the time that are like one use one use see results in one use but then you read the little fine print at the bottom and it says you will actually won't see any results for two to four weeks um, but with the with the state my chest was in I actually noticed a thickening of my skin after the very first use um, now I, I kept on using it I used a full one of these on my chest and my chest is like back to normal now um, but it was at the same time that I stopped binding I didn't bind anymore after I used this stuff um, that was like it was around the same time that I finally gave up binding and decided that I just couldn't take it anymore um, so I was wanting to restore my chest and I'm, I still have a lot of pain from binding actually um, but my skin is like completely better um, but yeah I just wanted to share that if your chest is getting really thin and it feels like it's gonna rip or if you're pre is mostly for pre-surgery to prep you for surgery if you're post-surgery and you have a thinning uh, skin on your chest I would definitely recommend putting this shit on um, to make sure that you don't have any uh, rips or tears that you aren't supposed to have in your chest after surgery because I know that there is that tightness where they connect this skin up here to the skin on your stomach um, and then they pull it together to and stitch it up and there's this tightness up here after surgery and that's what I was worried about that particularly is what I was worried about because I felt the way my chest was that if I were to have surgery that tightness that you feel up here would cause my skin to rip instead of just having the two scars that go like that I felt like I was gonna have this two scars that go like that as well as like shit tons of scars that go like that up and down just because my skin is ripping vertically because it was too thin so 
once again, Gold Bond Ultimate, restoring with COQ10. It's about $10 for a tube of 4.5 ounces. I found it at Walmart. I'm sure you can find it somewhere else. You can order it online. It's um, a pretty common product. It's not hard to find. But So that's my tip for all guys who are having problems with the elasticity in their skin. It'll probably work for older uh, trans people who actually have lost the elasticity in their skin naturally with age, too. So anybody who has got elasticity issues, I would recommend going out and getting this stuff. It took me about a whole tube before my skin felt back to normal. Alright, Wolfgang out.